Fine. What the hell? Hello, everyone. Did you miss me? Did you miss this intimacy? It's been so long since I talked directly into the camera. Oh my goodness, but I am bringing that back because I miss talking directly to y'all in my videos. Well, hey guys, and welcome back to Naturally Philo. Today, I'm doing a protein treatment. Yes, this is protein treatment 101. I'm gonna first educate y'all and then I'm gonna put some protein in my hair and we'll see how it goes. All right, I, this is my first time doing a protein treatment. I am 15 months natural. I know, I know. Where's my update? It's been so long since I did. I didn't even do my one year update. That's, that's like the most important one. <laughs> I went from one to 11 and then what happened to me? <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna do an update soon, but today it's all about protein. So let's get into this. Hey guys, thanks for sticking around. So let's begin. All right, so why a protein treatment? Well, for starters, our hair is composed of 90% protein. The protein in our hair is known as keratin, and keratin is responsible for providing our hair with that strength and that toughness for it to be managed from day to day, you know, um, and also for it to not break. But with constant pulling, tugging from different hairstyles, also exposure to sun, and too much moisture can deplete your hair of this protein keratin. And when that becomes the case, you notice your hair becomes really weak. It starts breaking more than usual. It starts shedding more than usual. And it's just, you know, not the way it, it was um, when you actually had a good amount of keratin in your hair. So, there are protein treatments out there that can temporarily repair your hair and give your hair, give the layers in your hair that coat of protein. And with that coat of protein, you will realize that your hair becomes really, really strong. Um, it won't be, you know, as dry or shed too much when you actually put that layer of protein because the hair is 90% protein, 90% keratin, it makes sense that you treat it with protein to restore the protein in your hair and give your hair that balance between moisture and protein. So with that lecture done, um, I my hair is moisture rich like I use the lock method so I have a lot of moisture in my hair that is not a problem um, but I'm 15 months natural and I've never done a protein treatment um, recently I picked out my, my hair into a fro and I realized that my hair I don't know it's it's very thick at the ends and Oh, wait, that sounds like a good thing. Okay, maybe that is a good thing. Mm, okay, scratch that. <laughs> I don't know, like, I experienced when I was combing through it with my afro pick, I experienced a lot of shedding and it just didn't feel the way it used to. And I don't know if that's because it's growing a lot. Like, it's probably that. But, um, I've also trimmed my hair only once and I probably need another trim. It was shedding and it wasn't shedding as usual like you know your hair sheds every day but what I was seeing was these like little pieces of hair and that's another thing if you are combing your hair and you see like you see the breakage in your comb and you see that that breakage you don't see that that cuticle you don't see the root tip on your comb but rather you see like little pieces of hair that you probably need a protein treatment because your hair is like breaking off not from the root but from like these itty bitty tips 
and when that's the case then you probably need some keratin love in your hair so that's what I've been experiencing and I did my research and I realized that I've never done a protein treatment so I researched different protein treatments um like protein treatments honestly like DIY is like number one for protein treatments so that's what I was thinking about doing but I read up on it and usually DIY protein treatments include eggs and mayonnaise eggs and mayonnaise I was like alright oh, whatever or Greek yogurt um I was like alright let me try this out apparently these eggs ain't doing anything these eggs ain't even going into your hair you are not infusing your hair with any of these any of the protein in the egg because apparently the protein in the egg is too big so I'm just like I'm thinking about this and I'm just like okay that makes sense because you, I'm, you're taking all raw and I wish I had an egg but I ate all the eggs today there were like there was like three more eggs in the house this morning and I ate them all. Now I ate two. One of them was broken. So I ate two of the eggs. Okay. So I don't have an egg to show you. But apparently the protein in an egg in an egg is too big to penetrate your hair shaft, to penetrate your hair strands. So your hair is getting that mayonnaise. Because mayonnaise is infused with a lot of rich oils that can penetrate your hair. So that's why, like, if you've ever tried a DIY protein treatment, your hair comes out really soft and shiny. Because that's the mayonnaise helping you out. But apparently, the protein in the egg is not getting into your head. Protein is made of amino acids. And the amino acids in the protein, in a raw protein egg, is too big to even get into your hair so you're not really getting that added protein when you use this egg and mayonnaise DIY um so I was like hmm that's interesting but but why is it too big so it's too big because it's it's a raw egg it hasn't been processed and what I mean by process is that um well the protein in order to break down amino acids, in order to break down a, a protein, and your the amino acids has to go through hydrolysis, and hydrolysis is basically the process by which you break down a compound, you break down a molecule. But because that didn't happen, because you're using the raw egg, your hair, you're honestly just washing away all the protein in the egg. It's not really infusing your um your hair with any protein um so i was just like okay so scratch out the diy so instead of doing a diy um i researched other protein treatments and that's why it's honestly sometimes it's really important to just buy a treatment instead of making it your own um, instead of making your own um so i researched some treatments um in addition, like depending on your hair type, depending on what level of hair damage you have, there are different protein treatments out there. So one of them is um, the one that I'm using today. So they rank from like really like high damage hair, moderate and just regular hair. Um, so I decided to get, go with the moderate. Um, protein treatment because well my hair is not damaged and this is my first time and yeah so I didn't want to go with high or low it's my first time so I just wanted to go with a moderate treatment and I came across this bad boy is hair mayonnaise it's a um, deep treatment infused with many proteins and it's from organic root stimulator and here's the consistency I don't know if you can see that but this is 
what I am using today. So I decided to go with this moderate protein treatment. Um, hair mayonnaise and it has it has it's enriched with olive oil, egg protein, herbs, and wheat germ oil. Um, wheat is infused with protein and also because it's infused with all of this protein you know that it's broken down it's been hydrolyzed so the protein will actually penetrate your hair penetrate your hair shaft and it will repair your your strands um, it will give your strands that um, temporary coating and I say temporary because this protein does not last it's not like perm it's not gonna permanently um, leave protein in your hair you don't have to do it do it ever, ever again um, it's temporary so I'm gonna do this like once a month just to give my hair that balance between protein and moisture <laughs> protein and moisture okay so let me take this off this is a picked out fro my hair is growing all right guys so you can't just put this in your hair just like that like my hair is dry right now so I'm gonna wash my hair I'm gonna condition my hair and then I'm gonna do the protein treatment and yes I'm still using these two products Shea Moisture's Raw Shea Butter line um, their shampoo and their conditioner so after I do that I'm gonna come back and we're gonna do this protein treatment I'm not washing my hair on camera because I already have a wash day video and I still do the same thing. <laughs> so watch that. But it's a protein treatment video and I'm going to go wash my hair and I'll be right back. So I began by sectioning out my hair into six sections. I can't quite get it into four sections because I'm dealing with two textures and it's just really hard to get into four sections. Um, next I took out one section and I began lathering it with the hair mayonnaise. Now you really need to put this all throughout your hair. Um, don't use too much because a little does go a long way but make sure you're really getting in there and you're applying it as if you were applying a perm actually. So just like that. <laughs> So next I began combing. It's very important to use a comb that has a lot of teeth so you can make sure you're really getting into each strand of hair. Um, next I sectioned off that section into two and I combed some more. Remember when you're combing to start from the bottom and work your way up. After combing, I twisted that section and went off to the next one. So here I'm just repeating the sequence so you can see it again. So the back of my head is a lot easier to work with, that's why I'm working with such a big section. But yeah, I'm doing the same exact thing. Next, I 
Me see your friend make up it too. Me mommy face paint till I think no. Girl, no mommy is a colleague. And I'm going to say I said to you. And if I want to, my mommy is a little bit of 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 Next, I put on a shower cap and it's time to let this treatment process. So I actually sat under a hooded dryer for 15 minutes. You can choose to just walk around with the shower cap on for 30 minutes to 60 minutes. But to speed up the process, I just sat under a hooded dryer. You can also use a handheld dryer as well. All right, so after everything, here is the result. Guys, this is a testimonial. I cannot tell you how much this product just saved my life. <laughs> After using this product, my hair just felt so soft. It was just so enriched, so coated with so much love, so much protein. My hair feels so good and it just feels like how it used to, you know? And I miss that feeling and I am telling you, Oh, also, this is my hair after I use the lock method, so I do have moisture in it. That's why it looks like this. But guys, I am telling you to please go get this product if you need a protein treatment because it just saved my life, okay? <laughs> Stop with the DIYs and get this protein treatment. <laughs> Alright, as always, remember to like comment and subscribe thank you so much for watching have a blessed day and until next time on naturally Philip. bye